We make it more complicated when we start thinking we need to handle more weight. The primary goal here is not to contract, not to lift weights. You're not a weightlifter. I'll never be a weightlifter. And for people out there that don't know what a weightlifter and a bodybuilder, what's the difference, I'm going to explain it to you. A bodybuilder is primarily concerned with contracting his muscles. Contracts his muscles against greater and greater amounts of resistance. By doing that, he's able to stimulate hypertrophy and make his muscles grow. So I'm looking for intense muscle contraction. Um, and it just so happens that I'm able to adjust the level of intensity you know, by adding weight or, track or, or subtracting weight. Primarily what's important to me is being able to make my muscles contract efficiently. I'm gonna get a stretch and a contraction. And I'm gonna be in control of it throughout the entire range of motion. Does that make sense? Stretch, 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 contract, stretch, 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 stretch. this in this fixed position and you're doing you know your bicep needs to stretch it needs to contract it needs to stretch it needs to contract because I'm not trying to move a tremendous amount of weight I'm trying to be mindful of the numbers the rep range and in a sense creating more volume so I did a lot more exercises then but well, this guy known for being massive to see him curling like 30 or 40 pound dumbbells, you might think, oh my god, I could do that, that's nothing. Um, but in truth, what I want to encourage you to think about if you should try this, is to imagine with each attempt to move the weight of the resistance. Imagine being able to contract, or to use your mind to command the muscles to contract as intensely as if you were standing in the mirror posing and essentially that's really what I'm trying to do underneath my sweatshirt and you can't see it because I have a sweatshirt on ah. oh, oh. yes here we go work come on work work Oh. Yeah, come on, push, push. Everything's in your front belt and your delts, and you're here. You're doing these movements. Ah, it feels good. Ah, ah, you get up, you pump, you feel like, ah, but you're not really training your bicep. So you might need to drop the weight, stretch, squeeze. Stretch, squeeze. That's it. 